Welcome back to the Gun Dungeon. We've got another ballistics gel test for you here today and another 30 super carry video. This is the Remington HTP, the high terminal performance. It's a hundred grain bullet. Pretty good looking little jacket at hollow point here. Looks pretty decent to me. It is hundred grains, as I said, rated at 1230 feet per second. We'll see, we got a chronograph set up here. We have jail block Jerry ready to ride the block. So we'll get him set on front. We got four layers of denim chronograph here. I'll get the camera set up and we'll just go ahead and get to shooting. Uh. 1,151 feet per second. And there's our wound trap. Little tumble there looks like. Little something there towards the end. Other than that, a pretty straight line wound track. Not a whole lot to ride home about there. And goes into the junk catch block in the rear. Hopefully you can see it sitting right there. This thing went 26 inches, almost 26. We're right at about 25 and three quarter or so. That ain't, that's not great. Let's try one more with the denim and see if we get the same results. And then we'll try one without the denim into this clear ballistics gel block. Think clear ballistics for helping channel out some here uh, so we'll shoot one more from this Smith & Wesson Shield Plus and see how it does uh. 1110 pretty anticlimactic again top track here not a lot guys not a lot went into the second wound or the second gel block here this one's resting right there at about 28 and 3 8 so it's getting a lot of penetrations because these bullets are not expanding let me try this third shot with no denim and see if we get a little bit better results Chronograph didn't pick that velocity up, but as you can tell, we actually have a wound track and an expanded bullet. Now this bullet did go on into the second block, right at 18, maybe a little over 18 and a quarter inches of penetration. Let's take a look at this track here. Now that doesn't look bad. That's a good looking wound track but that was also with no denim. Let's dig these bullets out, see what they look like. So there they are guys, in the order that they were shot. Clearly clogged with denim from these first two shots. Plenty of denim in there. Third shot with no denim performed great. That is perfect expansion. Uniform, pretty wide expansion. I think that one looks good. These other two didn't do anything. Well, there you have it, guys. Two of the three did not expand. These two were with denim. This one was without. How much that denim matters to you, only you can decide. I mean, the FBI made it a part of the standard test for a reason, and these bullets didn't do that great with the denim without it done perfect. Picture perfect, just like you would expect. I can't really say I've seen a whole lot of good stuff come from Remington lately, so it is what it is. Let me know in the comments what you all thought, and until next time, guys, stay tuned.